Hi guys, it's Jess with Techno House Inspections. I am on the roof of my afternoon inspection and I thought I would show you something um, that I come across and when I'm walking roofs I'm always on the lookout for and every now and then it makes me scurry over to a rafter or to the ridge or some solid surface. This one isn't too bad but it definitely makes me curious as to what I'll find in the attic. I have my own theories but we'll see. Um, I'm going to flip this around so hopefully you can kind of see what I'm talking about here. So I'm on the roof and um, I don't know if you can see my feet here, but in the center of them is a rafter. So this is actually a framing member here, but you can see how I am just rocking on the sheathing of this. This is the roof surface and it's like this all the way across. Here's another solid rafter and then see how I rock. I'm literally just, you know, that's the actual roof sheathing that is rocking like that. Um, and this area actually isn't all that bad compared to some of the other areas I walked across. So um, we'll see what I find in the attic. Um, usually when it's pretty consistent like this, I worry that the improper ventilation has caused, caused some issues, potentially mold in the attic. Sometimes it can be thinner roof sheathing that was used. So we'll see when I get there, but it's something A, to be cognizant of. If you have a roof that is safe enough to walk and you're walking your own roof, um, be aware that no, your roof sheathing should not do that. Um, if, if it does, you potentially have an issue and you should look in your attic, especially if it is just in one area, that could be a leak, especially around a roofing penetration. Um, <clears throat> so some things to keep in mind, I've got to get this stuff written up and I will talk to you guys later.